Well, hello, internet sheeples. Welcome to my video. Welcome to the Tycho Dragon Show. Today is a very special video because today I just woke up feeling great. <laughs> just felt amazing. The taste of freedom is great. You get to walk about, do whatever you please. But you know, it really dawned on me why they have to make it so fucking complicated. And the thing is, is that I love making videos for the internet, no matter who, how many people view them. You know, my channel is something special, something deeply human, something that will be studied in the history books for a long time. You know, I may not get millions of views like Logan Paul dance around with his fucking dick hanging out, but my videos show something in the human spirit, the human will to succeed. And you see, society is a certain way that they have to just make it so fucking complicated, don't they? You got all this shit that you have to worry about. I mean, that's the, what life in the West, but I would imagine everywhere in the world it's this way. They just have to make it fucking complicated. They have to make your life complicated. They have to make your social setting complicated. Everything is fucking complicated for human beings. And that make, begs the question, why? Why? Why is life so fucking difficult? They like to fucking make it. Oh, <laughs> they could have just let you live your life and be happy. Now the thing is with AI. AI technology is progressing at a feverish pace. And there's not gonna be a need to work much more. They're even talking about making uh, AI review lawyer law documents to 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 check over and to convict people. What the fuck kind of society is this? We're teetering, teetering on the brink of just complete uh, work culture collapse. You know, um, society itself is just changing. People can make money from nothing nowadays. What's the point of the fucking monetary system? You know, you got people with like crypto and, and all these schemes that they just end up rich or off of nothing and never contributing anything to society. Look at these like top R&B artists. They're shitty fucking people. Shitty people. Look at all the ones that got fucking in trouble. You know, shittiest people get ahead in this society. You know, and it's just like, it's just like Western culture, man. It just... It just, it just applauds the most wor worst, vile human beings that there is, and it's fucking bullshit. But I believe that the future will be different because, yeah, like definitely there could be something big that comes about, and yeah, fucking shit will change. <laughs> that's the, that's the overarching uh, uh, truth of this world: is that there's always going to be change. Change is always happening, no matter what. Um, and, and whatever you have now will one day just be different. That is the truth of this world. And, you know, fucking live your life. Live your life, you know, suicide rates have gone up over all over the society. You know, of all peoples, of all nations, everywhere. Why? Because social media and the fucking, uh, just, just the state of the world, you know? People have everything they could ever want now, but they have to struggle for it. Such bullshit. Such bullshit society we designed. We could have done so, 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 so much better. You know, you go out nowadays and you fucking see everywhere, everywhere, people's face. They're just fucking miserable. Just fucking miserable people. And it's like, I made a choice a long time ago to just not be one of those people. Fuck them. Fuck people. You know? People think they want to be fucking miserable, then go ahead and be that way. But I'm going to enjoy what life I have. What a life I've lived. What a fucking life I lived. What a story my life has been. If I could tell you all the details, growing up in the hood, you know, going through strife after strife after strife, after problem after problem after problem. You know, I live just in that median point between being lower class and upper class and just just at the median point, if not lower. 
So I felt the struggles, I felt the fucking the desire for change, and it, what a person I could be to 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 lead a more civilized, better society. Because you know, I've seen it, I've fucking lived it, I've lived a hell of a fucking story to get where I am now, and fuck, one day I'm gonna tell my tale, of course. But you know, it's it's a tale of. It's a, it's a deeply human tale, my story, and I could fucking tell it any day, and people would just, what a unique perspective on the world I have, because of what I've, what I've seen and what I've done, and you know, I, I'm deeply connected to nature, I love animals, I love nature, I love learning about science, and I think that that's at its core what it means to be human. At its core, what it means to be fucking human is to, 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 to discover and to learn and to, to, to feel pain and to feel happiness and to, you know, to get the most out of it. You know, like some people are so lucky; they just have everything. You know, they'll never, they'll never get to experience trials and tribulations that some people do. And you know, like you're talking to like a, someone who lives on the street in Mumbai compared to, you know, a fucking son of a rich, fucking upper class fucking guy, uh, father's a, a millionaire, gets everything he wants. There's, there's so many variations of humanity in this world. And it's, you could never feel bad about experiencing it all. You can't. I mean, I'm certain people, some people have goddamn fucking miserable stories just miserable stories they just their whole lives is just just, just shit uh, but you know part of the, I think part of the thing that people can do is to you know enjoy that you experience something just deeply human just deeply human uh, and to feel things that uh, this, this, these magical emotions that we were being given. Uh, we truly are the universe exploring itself. We're the universe discovering its own existence. Because without us, the whole just is nothing. It's all just a black, black void. But we have this beautiful planet. We've got all these things that we can can see and do and learn and discover and nowadays there's even more of that than there ever has been and <laughs> that's really what my channel is about it's just about just random craziness of life <laughs> and that's pretty much my story is my story was is just something that is just incredible and something that is just it just has to be told it's a story that just has got to be fucking told and I'm gonna fucking tell it. Cause I ain't giving up on my channel. I love posting videos, you know? People, I think people, what the problem is that people get hung up on success in life. You know, they don't have enough Instagram followers, they don't have enough Facebook friends. They don't, they don't, you know, they don't have this, they don't have that, but really, really, you have everything. You have everything in this universe because you, you have the gift of life. And the gift of life is something more important and something more valuable than anything money could ever buy. Not even Elon Musk could afford it. That's the gift of life. <laughs> that is the gift of life. The gift of life is true meaning and to, to strive towards something. Something bigger than ourselves. Something bigger than our emotions. Something that is just deeply and truly human. And uh, yeah, that's what it is. The gift of life. Just think about that for a second. You have been given the greatest gift of eternity. Never forget that. Never forget that you have the gift of life. 